King Enamaus of Pisa was well known for his unbeatable skills in chariot racing due to a divine gift. To get married to Enamaus's daughter Hippodamia, every suitor had to race with him. However, Enamaus had made a pact with Ares, the god of war, to slay every suitor who lost the race to prevent the prophecy that his son-in-law would bring about his death. This cruel tradition led him to be known as a tyrant. Pelops, one of Hippodamia's suitors, sought help from Poseidon, who presented him with a chariot and horses quicker than those Enamaus owned. In a dramatic race, Pelops outsmarted Enamaus and won Hippodamia's hand in marriage. However, Enamaus died a tragic death, while Pelops and Hippodamia lived joyfully ever after. Despite being remembered as a cruel king, Enamaus's love for wine is evident by his name, meaning, wine man. Pelops was the son of King Tantalus of Lydia and was in love with Hippodamia. He decided to raise her father, Enamaus, for her hand in marriage. Pelops was fearful of losing, so he turned to his former lover, Poseidon, for help. Poseidon granted Pelops a chariot with winged horses for the race. During the race, Pelops and Hippodamia replaced the linchpins of the chariot wheel with fake ones made of beeswax to gain an advantage over Enamaus. As they neared the finish line, the wheels flew off and broke apart, causing Enamaus to be dragged to his death by his horses. After the race, Pelops killed Enamaus' charioteer, Myrtilus, and was cursed by him. The curse affected Pelops' descendants through the generations, including Atreus, Thyestes, Agamemnon, Aegisthus, Menelaus, and Orestes. Myrtilus was buried in Olympia, which became known as a horse-frightening place during races. To honor Enamaus, the Olympic Games were created, and one of its origin legends was the chariot race with Pelops. The turning post of the race was preserved, and a burnt house of Enamaus was later reported by Pausanias in the 2nd century AD, adding to the mythology of the Olympic Games. Do you want to explore more Greek mythology stories? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.